In a bright and colorful classroom, standing by the whiteboard is Miss Amber, a lively and kind-hearted teacher known for her creative ways of teaching. Today is no ordinary math lesson, and Miss Amber can't wait to reveal her fun plan to the class. With a twinkle in her eye, she addresses everyone with excitement. Hey everyone! Today we are going to learn the two times table in a super fun way. With dance, the students cheer in delight, intrigued by the idea. As the upbeat music begins to play, Miss Amber leads the children into a simple warm-up dance, moving her feet and clapping her hands to the catchy rhythm. Come on everyone, let's move and groove, she encourages. Soon the classroom is filled with giggles and moving feet as the students dance along, warming up for the learning adventure ahead. Next, Miss Amber picks up her marker and writes the two times table on the whiteboard. Two times one is equal to two, two times two is equal to four, and continues up to two times 10 is equal to 20. She reads each equation aloud, her voice in tune with the beat as she claps along. See, math and music go hand in hand, she says. Now comes the most exciting part. Miss Amber turns each multiplication step into a lively dance move. Two times one is equal to two, she chants, stepping forward and clapping. Two times two is equal to four, she says, executing two side steps followed by a delightful spin. Two times three is equal to six. It's a leap and two claps. The students mimic her moves, laughing and learning how rhythms and numbers fit together. Miss Amber, with a twinkle in her eye, turns to face the class once more. Please like, share, and subscribe my Manu Kids TV channel. Let's see who remembers our dance moves. What comes next? She inquires while cleverly erasing some numbers. The students are ready, bouncing on their toes as they confidently call out the answers. Two times four is equal to eight. The room is filled with energy and on-point answers as they all dance through their answers. To wrap up this musical journey, Miss Amber leads her eager learners through the entire table one last time. Each step and spin becoming second nature. You did it. You danced your way through the two times table. She cheers, giving high fives and hearty cheers for a job well done. With a final flourish of a fun dance move and a thumbs up, Miss Amber closes the lesson, leaving a trail of excitement and newfound confidence behind. And that's how the class mastered the two times table, a vivid memory forever marked by music and motion.